सदाशिव सरंभा शंकराचार्य मध्यमा अस्मदाचार्य पर्यता वंदे गुरुपरंपरा श्रुतिस्मृतिपुराण आलय करुणाल नमा भगवत्द शंकर लोकशंक शंकर शंकराचार्य केशव बादरायण सूत्रभाष्यतौ वंदे भगवत ईश्वरो गुरुरात्मे मूर्ति भेद विभागिने व्योमद्याप्तहाय दक्षिणाूर्त नम ओं सहना सहनो भुनक्त सह वीरवाह तेजस्वीनावदीतमस्तु मा विषा वह ओं शांत शांत शांति धातु ब्रह्म संप्रोक्त जीव आख्यात्य प्रकृति कृसुभंतादीर्धातु ब्रह्मात्म नम नारायण परो व्यक्ता दंडम व्यक्त संभव अंडस्यांतस्ति मे लोका सप्तद्वीपा चे दिनी सो वी वेर एट फोर्टी एट श्लोका इन द सेकेंड चैप्टर वेर भगवान सेट किंच अन्यत मोर ओवर ही सेट समथिंग एल्स ऑल्सो यू शुड नो इफ यू फॉलो कर्म योगा नेहा विक्रमनाशोस्ति प्रत्यवायो न विद्यते स्वल्पमप्यस्य धर्मस्य त्रायते महतो भयात ही सेस न इह न इह न इह अभिक्रम नाशो अस्ति अभिक्रमस्य नाशः नास्ति इत्यर्थ नाशः अस्ति प्रत्यवायः न विद्यते देर इज नो प्रत्यवाय दोष ऑल्सो स्वल्पम अपी अस्य धर्मस्य त्रायते महतो भयात महत भयात त्रायते न इह हियर हियर इन द सेंस इन दिस मोक्ष मार्ग वेन यू फॉलो वेन यू फॉलो दि कर्मयोग प्रोसेस then what happens abhikrama nasha nasti abhikrama is actually the beginning the uh, arambha and arambha means arambha nasha arambha is for a result for something you undertake something to get some result for a phala asha however if you give that up here abhikrama nasha you will get a result anyway and then the prayojana nasha is not there you will get the result finally the purushartha siddhi will happen in the long run if you follow karma yoga that is what bhagwan is intending to say and he says pratyavayah na vidyate and since you have followed your dharma therefore pratyavayah dosha which is a dosha when you do not follow your dharma then the dosha which accrues to a person is called pratyavayah dosha however here uh, bhashyakara says that this is pratyavayah uh, here need not necessarily mean only that uh, dosha which comes by not following dharma but he says a side effect also he gives the example we saw last time i had mentioned that chikitsavat chikitsavat means like taking medication there may be some side effect however as in a counter example is given na tatha if you take a wrong medicine here you follow some krama and then you make some mistakes there in uh, when you are following dharma for results that time you make a mistake then you will not get the result however here you are not interested in the result at all the main result is you are not interested you are interested in chitta shuddhi therefore when you of follow karma yoga you do it because it is a duty trusted unto you then anyway you are not interested in the main result the result is going to be chitta shuddhi and that you are anyway going to get even if you make few mistakes here and there therefore there is no side effect so pratyavayah na vidyate there is no here i'll mention that it is here it is side effect specifically the meaning is side effect because chitta shuddhi cannot have a side effect you will get chitta shuddhi the main result may or may not accrue to you if you make mistakes but then anyway you didn't want that result at all you are not looking forward to that result because you have offered it unto the lord of course in detail will uh, bhagwan will explain this later so here he saying na vidyate pratyavayah na vidyate 
स्वल्पमपि अस्य धर्मस्य त्रायते महत महतो भयात स्वल्पमपि इफ एन इफ यू फॉलो अ लिटी स्वल्पमपि अस्य धर्मस्य महता भयात त्रायते सो आई जस्ट शो यू हियर यू सी स्वल्पमपि भाष्यकार इन दोर्टी एच लोक हियर ही सेज सी इह मोक्ष मार्गे इन दिस मोक्ष मार्ग कर्मयोगे एंड वेन यू आर डूइंग कर्मयोग इन दिस मोक्ष मार्ग वेन यू आर फॉलोइंग कर्मयोग देन अभिक्रम नाश अभिक्रम विथ अभिक्रम प्रारंभ तस् नाश नास्ति यथा कृष्यादेहे ही सेज लाइक इन फार्मिंग वेर यू मेक अ मिस्टेक दैट टाइम यू लूज द रिजल्ट इफ यू यू कांट मेक अ बिगिनिंग एट अ रॉन्ग टाइम इन कृषि in farming you cannot make end up making some beginning you sow the seeds when you should not sow based on which crop you want you have to look at the seasonal uh, you, you have to look at the seasons you have to look at the weather conditions you have to look at the lot of things there's a krama and then if you make a mistake then there what will happen is that you will not get get a crop at all there is a nasha here though you will get some result therefore there is no avikrama nasha and pratyavaya pratyavaya uh, na vidyate means what na vidyate here he says uh, chikitsavat i mentioned chikitsavat then he says kintu swalpo api asya dharmasya anushthitam anushthitam because there will be no anvaya otherwise swalpo api asya asya dharmasya trayate mahato bhaya what is the anvaya here so swalpo asi anushthitam so even स्वल्पम अनुष्ठितम अपी अस्य धर्मस्य स्वल्पम अनुष्ठितम अपी महतो भयात त्रायते इवन इफ देर इज अ लिटिल फॉलोइंग यू फॉलो इट फॉलो दि धर्म इवन अ लिटिल दैट लिटिल एफर्ट विल टेक यू अ लॉन्ग वे बिकॉज इट विल प्रोटेक्ट यू फ्रॉम महाभया ऑफ संसारा महत भया मीन्स महद भया ऑफ संसारा सो वील एड दैट टू दि अन्वया हियर इन दि एंड वील हेव टू से स्वल्पम अपी अस्य धर्मस्य अस्य धर्मस्य स्वल्पम अपी अनुष्ठितम महतः भयात त्रायते will uh, improvise on the uh, anvaya but here eha abikramah abikramanashah shashti tatpurusha abikramasya nashah nasti and pratyavayah na vidyate anushtitam has been added अनुष्ठित कर्म स्वल्पमी अनुष्ठित कर्म और धर्म अनुष्ठित कर्म महता भया त्रायते सो दैट इज वॉट भाष्य एंड वॉट इज महत भया संसार भया विच इज जन्म मरणादि लक्षण भया संसार इज जन्म मरणादि लक्षण एंड दैट कण ऑफ भया वन इज प्रोटेक्टेड फ्रॉम फर्दर भाष्यकर असेज जी कनेक्ट टू दी नेक्स्ट वर्स विच सेज ये यम सांख्ये ये यम सांख्ये बुद्धिरुक्ता योगे च सो या इम ये यम इज या इम सांख्ये योगे च बुद्धि उक्ता विच हैज बीन मेन्शन एज सांख्ये बुद्धि एंड योगे बुद्धि द डिविजन विच वॉज मेन्शन अर्लियर ऑफ कर्मयोगा एंड द कमिटमेंट टू कर्मयोगा एंड कमिटमेंट टू ज्ञान योगा वक्षमाण लक्षण असा दिस दिस विल बी टॉक्ड अबाउट फर्दर दैट विच इज दिस सांख्य बुद्धि एंड योग बुद्धि सांख्य बुद्धि एंड योग बुद्धि विच हैज बीन मेन्शन दैट इज गोइंग टू बी एलॉबरेटेड फर्दर वक्षमाण इट इज गोइंग टू बी टॉक्ड अबाउट फर्दर वॉट आर इट्स कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स दोज विल बी मेन्शन हाउ हाउ सांख्य बुद्धि शुड बी हाउ योग बुद्धि शुड बी दैट इज बींग मेन्शन हियर एंड Uh, individually they are talked about here in 41st shloka 
he says what is that buddhi vyavasayatmika buddhir ekeh kurunandana bahushaka yanantascha buddhayo vyavasayinam so vyavasayatmika vyavasaya atmika buddhi hi eka ih kurunandana bahushaka hi anantaha cha बुद्धयः अव्यवसायी नाम डेट इज ए पद छेदा देन ही सेस सो व्हाट इज व्यवसाय इतमिका बुद्धि ही एका हियर इट इज एका व्यवसाय इतमिका बुद्धि इज एका दैट कमिटमेंट व्हिच इज अनटू इधर ऑफ दिस whether it is sankhya to sankhya or to yoga it will be a single pointed commitment you can't say that i am a karma yogi and a jnana yogi together because that uh, that has been denied by bhashyakara you can be but it will not lead to moksha you can claim to be doing karma yoga and following jnana yoga together but that will not result in moksha moksha will be due to jnana alone However, saha samuchya is not possible. There is krama samuchya. Finally, you will have to give up kar karma yoga, karma, karma yoga. So, when karma yoga itself is denied for uh, a jnana yogi, then karma obviously is denied. It is uh, karma yoga is by denying karma yoga, karma or uh, any type of karma, whether it is laukika karma or whether it is uh, the not nitya nimittika karma which is karma yoga but the kamya yoga, kar, kamya karma also vaidika karma is also denied for a person who for whom karma yoga itself is denied to follow jnana yoga for moksha so here vyavasayatmika buddhi eka ih he kuru nandana he kuru nandana kuru nandana one who is born in kuru family Arjuna, he Kuru Nandana, iha vyava sayatmika buddhi hi eka bhavati. Eka bhavati. What is this vyava sayatmika buddhi hi? Strilinga, eka iha Kuru Nandana. संबोधन विभक्ति प्रथमा संबोधन एंड बहुशाखा हा ही अनंता हा बहुशाखा हा प्रथमा भोवचन अनंता हा प्रथमा भोवचन अगेन इन सामान्य दिक्कतें बहुशाखा हा च बुद्धया हा इन सामान अधिकरण है बुद्धि विच स्त्रीलिंगा बुद्धया हा इन प्लूरल अव्यवसाई नाम फॉर डोज हु आर नॉट व्यवसाई सो हियर फॉर डोज हु आर व्यवसाई फॉर देम व्यवसाय आत्मिका बुद्धि एकाव होती एंड फॉर अव्यवसाई व्हाट हैपेंस अव्य अव्यवसाई नाम तू हो दिस बुद्धया हा अनंता हा भोषा we will look into what these means. So, Bahushaka means what? Having many branches. This Bahuri, that those which have many shakas, many branches. And this is the buddhi. When a person is thinking, if you do not have a straightforward thinking. So, what is the uh, lakshana of manaha? Sankalpa vikalpatmaka manaha. Mind is that which is sankalpa vikalpatmaka manaha. Uh, it's neuter, so manaha, manas is the pratipadikam, sankalpa vikalpatmakam manaha. That which is always thinking endlessly, raising some doubts and not being able to resolve it. So it keeps on making dvandva, giving options. Mind will always bring up confusions and even if you are not confused, you do not know, you are not able to decide which path to take. So, mind always brings up a lot of options. So, it is necessary for analysis. However, conclusive effort is done by buddhi, the antakkarana which plays the role of manaha 
as well as buddhi when it plays the role of buddhi that time it becomes nischayatmika nischayatmika buddhi this vyavasayatmika is similar meaning nischayatmika that buddhi which is nischayatmika that is eka you can conclude only when buddhi is in play you have viveka and you can uh, take the mind to conclusion lead the mind to conclusion and thereby vyavasayatmika buddhi and what actually it is meant here is that entire vedas have eka vakyata they are committed to a single purushartha really single goal and that goal for moksha is the mahavakya all other vakyas are called as avantara vakyas all the veda vedanta vakyas even karma kanda vakyas they lead you to do some kamya karma if you analyze and you understand this kamya karmas are not going to give me uh, nitya sukha then slowly they will lead you to you will drop off this kamya karma and then start doing only nitya nimittika karma which will lead to chitta shuddhi vaya karma yoga which is karma yoga nitya nimittika karma following that without expectation of result because nitya nimittika karma do not have any result other than countering pratyavaya dosha if you do not follow nitya nimittika karma then pratyavaya dosha accrues if you follow nitya nimittika karma there is no additional result there the only result is what pratyavaya it blocks it it stops your durita form from from fructifying into prarabdha which will bring in suffering therefore if nitya nimittika karma is followed with commitment to chitta shuddhi parmeshwara prithyartha means to lead to chitta shuddhi then it will lead to chitta shuddhi and thereby one is moved away from this karma kanda commitments and then one comes to vedanta where the eka vakya tha is clearly seen if you analyze that what is the moral of the story what is vedanta all vedantas are committed to what they are committed to eka vakya tha to show that you are not different from ishwara so that is vyavasayatmika buddhi in the end here though sankhe or karma yogi they you are not thinking endlessly as to what to do uh, how to get this result nothing is there in karma yoga because you want chitta shuddhi even if there are some mistakes in following they are okay because you will finally you should do at with the best of your ability but finally it will give you chitta shuddhi any which way even if you make some mistakes because you will ask for forgiveness in the end anyway but if it is a kamya karma and you want results that time if you make mistakes you won't not only get results but papa can accrue therefore uh, what has been said earlier is that pratyavayo na vidyate eh eh moksha marge and karma yoge pratyavaya na vidyate there is no side effect like papa ityadi now vyavasayatmika buddhi eka therefore once the buddhi does viveka and you are able to follow karma yoga with that commitment or follow jnana yoga with commitment then vyavasayatmika buddhi eka bhavati ih and what is vyavasayatmika uh, you can see atma is pullinga but atmika is trilinga therefore this is bahuri this is bahuri and what kind of a uh, vyavasaya vyavasaya atma uh, yasyaha buddhehe sa buddhi vyavasayatmika buddhi so it will be 116 bhauri meaning what vyavasaya vyavasaya atma atma here is what atma is equal to swabhavah swabhavah yasyah buddhehe sa buddhi sa buddhi hi vyavasayatmika so it is in samana dekhna buddhi that is eka here it is one but if it is not eka then it is not vyavasayatmika so person is not following the thoughts to conclusion and thereby the mind goes on everywhere it keeps on jumping like a monkey mind which is its nature then vyavasaya is, is not happening there avyavasaya is happening and mind takes the buddhi for a ride because the antakarana does not have bandwidth to become buddhi it remains manaha and then sankalpa vikalpa 
keeps on continuing and thereby a person becomes avyavasai. So avyavasai nam tu, cha, cha in tu artha, in contrast, avyavasai nam buddhayaha anantaha. Why anantaha? Ananta means limitless, unending. Why? Because bahushakaha. There are many branches to thoughts. One thought leads to another and then another and another, maybe more than one thought and thereon each thought leads to multiple thoughts and thereby the thinking is endless. One is never able to conclude, should I do this, should I do that, should I do this karma, this says that I will get dhana, if I do this I will have bahuputra labha, if I do this I will get swarga, if I do this something else will happen to my enemy, I can take advantage of that also and thereby the Vedas are ananta. We, it will come to the next sloka, we will talk about Vedas, but this is the introduction to that, saying that Bahu Shaka. So, He Kurnanda, Iha Vyavasayatmika Buddhi Eka Bhavati. Otherwise, what happens is that Avyavasayinam, Avyavasayinam, Tu, Tu is, this Cha is in Tu Artha here, or Avyavasayinam, He indeed, He Cha, Bahu Shaka. And being Bhavushaka, Bhavushaka is the Hetu Garva Visheshana there, Bhavushaka ha Ananta ha Buddhaya So, Vyavasayanam Buddhi Buddhaya ha Buddhaya ha Vyavasayanam hi Buddhaya ha Cha Bhavushaka ha Ananta ha Bhavanti और भवुषा कहा, being भवुषा का, देव अनंता हा भवंती, thereby it remains endless. ये शाम यवसायत्मिका बुद्धिर नास्ती ते, and further what happens this अव्यवसायी नाम, for this अव्यवसायी नाम, ये शाम, so they are ये शाम, for these अव्यवसायी, those who cannot take these ideas to conclusion, they don't know what is the commitment that there are two paths taught in Gita, when they do not understand this, they remain avyavasai and avyavasai nam yesham yesham vyavasayatmika buddhir nasti. What happens? Te yam imam pushpitam vacham pravadantya vavashitaha vedavadarata partha nanya nasti iti vadinaha. So yam imam pushpitam vacham yam imam पुष्पितां वाचम प्रवदन्ति अव्यपश्चितः नंजतत्पुरुषः न व्यपश्चित न अव्यपश्चितः न व्यपश्चितः अव्यपश्चितः हियर दिस इज अ लिटिल डिफिकल्ट कंस्ट्रक्ट इट इज पुरुषोदरादिवत् साधु द डेरिवेशन इज नॉट क्लियर हियर सो इट इज सेड पुरुषोदरादिवत् साधु बिकॉज़ विशेषण पश्चति that kind of a meaning is there, but then how this forms comes, form comes about to be uh, paschati, chetati, va, that kind of meaning is there, that is vipaschita and na vipaschita, a vipaschita. Veda vada rata, veda vada rata, partha, na anya asti, iti vadinaha, iti vadinaha. These same people. Avyavasayis are called here as Vadis. They are Vadinaha. They keep on talking about something. What they what do they talk about? They talk about He Partha. O Partha. They Pravadanti. Who this Avipaschitaha Vadinaha Vedavata Rataha. These are all Prathama Vibhakti. Bahuvachana, these vadis, vada yeshamasti te vadinaha and avipaschita means avivekinaha, those who are aviveki and what are they? They are veda vada, vedanam vadaha, veda vadaha and veda vadeshu prataha, prataha is kartari ta here, prataha, those who are rejoicing. Rejoicing in what? In Vada. What kind of Vada? Veda Vada. Vedanam Vada. They keep on talking about what is there in Vedas. In Karmakanda. Here Veda is Karmakanda. In Karmakanda what all is there? 
what all phalas are talked about what are the means of doing it what is a good uh, offering here what if you offer this what kind of a phala bheda will you get so all these which devata should you do uh, upasana and uh, puja of all these discussions are there and swarga swarga is their goal how to get more and more happiness here and hereafter although that happiness is not mithya so uh, vedanam vadaha vedavadaha vedavadeshu rataha is saptami tatpurusha so what do these people who are vadis so vadinaha 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 and what what are these people talking about since they are vedavadarataha vedavadarataha and who are they aviveki therefore avipaschitah so avipaschitah vedavadarataah vadinah and who are these vadina what are these people what is their vada so vada this is matuparte ini so tadasya asti asmin iti matu and that matuparte ini means those who have these vada what is their vada न अन्यदस्ति इति वादिनः सो दिस इज देयर वादा देयर वादा इज इति व्हाट इज दैट इति न अन्यदस्ति अन्यद मींस नथिंग अदर अदर देन व्हाट अदर देन व्हाट दे आर टॉकिंग अबाउट ऑल दीस वेद वादास व्हिच दे आर मेकिंग अदर देन दिस वेद कर्मकांड देयर इज नथिंग एल्स व्हाटएवर इज देयर इन द कर्मकांड व्हिच देवता इज टॉक्ड अबाउट व्हिच marga is talked about which offerings all the karakas which are talked about in the vedas karmakanda and what is their phala other than that there is nothing else so na anyadasti anyad means other than whatever is there in the karmakanda anyad kimapi nasti anyad anyad nasti iti vadinah so anyad nasti iti vadinah who are now we can shift this anyad nasti iti vedavadaratah and anyad nasti iti vadinah avipaschita because they cannot do any more viveka that how vedanta is different from there is a segregation of vedas into karma kanda and jnana kanda that they cannot see therefore they are committed only to this and what are what is their talk their talk is uh, pravadanti what do they avipaschita pravadanti this is the verb here prakarshena vadanti in detail they will keep on talking endlessly on entire karma kanda you ask them any question they will be able to answer but only limited to the karma and its variety and what are what is their talk their talk is very flowery flowery pushpitam vacham because they will always talk about the, a guaranteed result you know you do this you will get it so pushpitam vacham vadanti vak vak is a strilinga सो पुष्पिता वाचम इन द्वितीया विभक्ति प्रवदंती अवपश्चित अविपश्चित प्रवदंती व्हाट डू दे टॉक सो कर्मा फॉर दैट गोज इन सेकंड केस याम इमाम पुष्पिता वाचम प्रवदंती सो इमाम दिस काइंड ऑफ अ टॉक व्हिच इज दैट फ्लावरी इट इज अ वेरी फ्लावरी लैंग्वेज they keep on explain it which is very pleasant to hear also oh you do this you offer this to this devata you do this puja you do this you will get this result so there is there is a limit it not that you should not do it if a person wants it one should do it but nanya dasti iti vadina that is not true anyat nasti iti vadina ha therefore aviveki and then they say whatever is talked about here ya imam pushpitam vacham prati all these kind of talks they will be making then bhagwan further says bhagwan bashakara says techa and these very people techa he is using continuation because these very people uh, they speak something else also or what is that they speak this what is that vak what is that characteristic of vak that is being shown here so this is all uh, please mark the cases as feminine and uh, sorry second case singular all this is second case singular in 
सामनाधिकरणम विथ पुष्पित विथ वाक वाचम प्रवदंती लटलकार बहुवचन बिकॉज ऑल दीज इज बहुवचन एंड हे पार्थ संबोधना न अन्यद अस्ति वादी दिस इज फर्स्ट केस अन्यदस्ती वादी सो वॉट अबाउट दम ते च एंड दे कामात्मा कामात्मान स्वर्ग परा जन्म कर्म फल प्रदा क्रिया विशेष बहुलाम भोगेश्वर्य गति प्रति सो दे आर ते फर्दर हु आर दीज पीपल वादी दे आर कामात्मा काम आत्मा येशांते बहुरी येशांते कामात्मा एंड आत्मा हियर इज अगेन स्वभाव आत्मा इज इन नॉट मुख्य आत्मा नॉट दी अंतकरण ऑल्सो काम आत्मा मीनिंग स्वभाव देर नेचर इज ओनली डिजायरस वेरी डिजायरस काम आत्मा स्वभाव ये कामात्मा हु आर दीज वेदवादरता नान्यदस्ती वादी एंड अवपश्य दे आर वॉट स्वर्गपरा दे आर स्वर्गपरा दिस इज ऑलसो बहुरी एज वॉट स्वर्ग बिकॉज दे आर वॉट इज वेद आर गोइंग टू गिव यू कर्मकांड एंड उपासना विल फाइनली गिव यू स्वर्ग डन वेल इट कैन गिव यू स्वर्ग और इट कैन गिव यू समदर लोका पितृलोका ब्रह्मलोका ऑल दीज आर कैन बी कॉल्ड टुगेदर एज स्वर्ग और बाय एक्सटेंशन ब्रह्मलोका अप टू हिरण्य गर्भ पदवी इज इंक्लूडेड देयर एट द मोस्ट यू कैन बिकम हिरण्य गर्भ नथिंग मोर देन दैट इज पॉसिबल एंड हिरण्य गर्भ ऑल दो इट इज अ लॉन्ग 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 पीरियड ऑफ टाइम अक्रॉस मेनी मेनी कल्पा स्टिल it will not many kalpa at the end of the kalpa sorry at the end of the kalpa many yugas but at the end of the kalpa even that brahma hiranya garbha will be resolved into uh, into its karana into brahma or avyakta and therefore that result will also come to an end so swarga will come to an end swarga paraha para is in a commitment swarga is commitment for whom swarga para yesham te स्वर्गपरा एंड वॉट डू दे टॉक अबाउट वाचम दिस वाचम दिस वाक इन सेकेंड केस हैज मोर एडजेक्टिव दिस वाक वॉट दे टॉक अबाउट ऑल दैट इज दीज दे आर स्वर्गपरा सो देर फोर दे विल टॉक अबाउट वॉट विल दे टॉक अबाउट दे विल टॉक अबाउट मीन्स एंड वॉट इज दैट स्वर्ग फाइनली इट इज अनित्य देर फोर जन्म कर्म फल प्रदाम that vak is finally going to lead you to janma and karma phala and or here uh, bhashyakar says janma cha karma cha uh, he says karma karmana phalam karmana phalam karmana phalam is karma phalam shashti tat purusha there and then janma janma eva karma phalam You can say dwandva also janma cha karma phalam because the janmaadi are the karma phalam. So uh, you can make dwandva also there. Karma phala is one where it is shasti tat purusha. Then janma and karma phala are two entities. So dwandva is possible there. But Bhasya Kara makes a karma dharaya there to show that whatever you do from karma kanda, whether it is upasana or any karma, the best of the karmas can get you swarga. But that swarga is anitya. Finally, you will get janma. Here and hereafter, you will keep on getting janma because your sanchita is not going to end. It will go only by jnana, and karma definitely cannot bring an end to it. Therefore, karma na phalam, karma phalam, janma eva karma phalam, janma karma phalam, and then janma eva karma phalam, and then further the samasa with pradamit. Pradam, you see, da 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 tu you see there. Uh, दादाने सो प्रकर्षेण ददा सो उपपद तत्पुरुष जन्म कर्म फल प्रकर्षेण ददा 
इति प्रदा एंड देन इन सेकंड केस प्रदाति इति वाक प्रदाति इति वाक दैट वाक व्हिच हैज बीन टॉक्ड अबाउट अर्लियर द काइंड ऑफ टॉक दैट दे मेक इन द अर्लियर श्लोका व्हिच वाज गिवन एंड ताम वाचम सो ताम वाचम ताम वाचम ताम वाचम and then tam vacham what there is no there is no verb here and that verb has to be brought from the earlier pravadanti this verb has to be brought down so there is an anuvrutti of pravad pravadanti here so you have to say pravadanti it's going across pages very difficult ओके सो जन्म कर्म फल प्रदाम वाचम प्रवदंती हु आर दिस कामात्मा सो दी कामात्मा कामात्मा प्रवदंती एंड व्हाट डू दे टॉक अबाउट दे टॉक अबाउट दिस वाचम विच वाचम जन्म कर्म कामात्मा स्वर्गपरा कामात्मा स्वर्गपरा स्वर्ग परा कामात्मा स्वर्ग परा इज एक्चुअली हेतु गर्व विशेषण बीइंग स्वर्ग परा बीइंग कमिटेड ओनली टू स्वर्ग नथिंग बियॉन्ड दैट देर फोर दे आर कामात्मा दे वॉन्ट स्वर्ग अलोन दे वॉन्ट स्वर्ग एंड स्वर्ग लाइक एक्सपीरियंसेस दे डोंट वॉन्ट एनीथिंग एल्स न अन्यदस्ती वादी देर फोर कामात्मा एंड दे वाचम प्रवदंती वॉट कैंड ऑफ वाचम प्रवदंती जन्म जन्म कर्म फल प्रदाम वाचम प्रवदंती सो कीप ऑन एडिंग मोर एंड मोर वर्ड्स एंड व्हाट एल्स इज देयर हियर यू सी अनदर सो अनदर वर्ड हियर सेज सी अनदर वर्ड हियर क्रिया विशेष बहुलाम क्रिया विशेष बहुलाम सो बहुलम बहुला इज बहुलाति दैट विच ब्रिंग्स मेनी दैट विच ब्रिंग्स मेनी कैंड ऑफ थिंग्स वॉट आर दिस क्रिया विशेष क्रिया विशेष षष्टी तत्पुरुष क्रिया विशेष क्रिया विशेष एंड क्रिया विशेष बहुला इट इज इन सामनाधिकरण स्त्रीलिंग वाक् सो क्रिया विशेष बहुलाम और यासाम यस्याम और यासाम दैट इन इन विच इन विच देर इज क्रिया विशेष आर मेनी देर आर मेनी वेज टू डू पर्टिक्युलर थिंग्स क्रिया विशेष क्रिया विशेष आर मेनी सो यू लुक एट भाष्य हियर यू विल सी क्रिया विशेष बहुला क्रिया विशेष क्रिया विशेष ते बहुला यस्याम यस्याम वाची इन विच वाक क्रिया विशेष द एक्सप्लेनेशन ऑफ क्रिया इज वेरी एलोबरेट दे टेल यू विच द्रव्या टू यूज वॉट कैन बी रिप्लेस इफ यू डोंट हैव दैट द्रव्या विच कैन बी ए रिप्लेसमेंट और विच इज इवन बेटर देन दैट देर आर मल्टीपल सेक्शन वेर समथिंग ग्रेडेशन ऑफ द्रव्याज आर गिवन दे टेल यू विच इज बेटर गुड इफ यू कैन फॉलो दैट गुड बट न अन्य दस्ती वाद नथिंग मोर देन दैट इज पॉसिबल एक्चुअली नथिंग मोर इज पॉसिबल बाय कर्मा बट दे डू नॉट नो दैट दे थिंक दैट नथिंग एल्स इज पॉसिबल एनी विच वे Only Swarga is the goal. Thereby Kriya Vishesha Bahulam Bahuri here. I'll just mark it as Bahuri. Bhoga Ishwara Gatim Prati. So uh, you can take this as qualifying the Kriya Vishesha. Qualifies the Kriya Vishesha there. Again as Vak Bhoga Ishwara Gatim Prati Kriya Vishesha Bahulam Vak Vacham Pravadanti. भो दिस इज द्वंद्वा भोग एंड ऐश्वर्या भोग ऐश गति दिस स्प्लिट इज भोग ऐश्वर्या एंड गति विद इन दी समासा भोगं च ऐश्वर्यं च भोग ऐश्वर्ये दिस इज द्वंद्वा इतरेतर द्वंद्वा सो फर्स्ट एंड इतरेतर द्वंद्वा एंड देन इतरेतर द्वंद्वा एंड देन भोग ऐश्वर्ये भोगेश्वर्यो गति गति प्राप्ति हियर 
इसी भाष्य करा से प्राप्ति ही ही से तयो हो गति ही इज इक्वल टू प्राप्ति अटेनमेंट गति इज बिकॉज एनी कर्म कर्म फला विल हैव अ गति इन्वॉल्व देयर सो गति इज प्राप्ति हियर देयरफॉर इट इज षष्टि तत्पुरुष तयो हो प्राप्ति प्राप्ति ऑफ भोग एंड ऐश्वर्य सो गति ऑफ भोग एंड ऐश्वर्य मीन प्राप्ति ऑफ भोग ऐश्वर्य दैट कैंड ऑफ वाक प्रवदंती सो भोग ऐश्वर्य गति प्रतिक्रिया विशेष बहुलाम वॉट एवर वेराइटी इज एवेलेबल इन कर्मा दे इन क्रिया दोज कैंड ऑफ थिंग्स दे टॉक अबाउट इन देअर स्पीच विच विल लीड टू भोग एंड ऐश्वर्य सो भोग ऐश्वर्य हियर यार क्रिया क्रिया विशेष श बहुलाम एंड व्हाट इज दैट क्रिया विशेष बहुलाम प्रति टुवर्ड्स समथिंग व्हाट इज दैट प्रति टुवर्ड्स भोगा एंड ऐश्वर्य भोग ऐश्वर्य पर्य गतिम प्रति गतिम प्रति क्रिया विशेष बहुलाम जन्म कलम कर्म फल प्रदाम वाचम प्रबोधंती हुआ दे स्वर्ग परा कामात्मा ना सो दैट इज द अनवया आई होप नथिंग इज लेफ्ट कामात्मा स्वर्ग परा जन्म कर्म या भोगेश्वर या सो दिस इज द अनवया हियर तेशाम चो एंड फॉर दिस अव्यवसायी नाम व्हाट हैपेंस तेशाम चो भोगेश्वर्य प्रसक्ता नाम तया पहुँत चेत who are kamatmanaha, tesham kamatmananam. So for them what happens is that bhoga ishwarya for this avyavasai nam bhoga ishwarya prasaktanam prasaktanam prasakta means those who are committed to those those who are committed to those bhoga and aishwarya for them, for those people. तया अपहृत चेतसाम तया अपहृत चेतसाम तेशाम सो फॉर फॉर दीज पीपल भोग ईश्वर्य प्रसक्ता नाम षष्टि बहुवचन तया तया अपहृत चेतसाम व्यवसायात्मिका बुद्धि ही समाधौ न विधीयते समाधि इज अ पुल्लिंग Unlike in other languages like Hindi, in Hindi samadhi is trilinga, in Sanskrit samadhi is pullinga, it is a ski pratyanta, na vidhiyate, na vidhiyate. What happens for them who are svarga paraha kamatmana? Because they are always engaged in meeting their desires. Therefore what happens, bhoga and aishwarya being their commitment, they are bhoga aishwarya prasakta. एंड भोगेश्वरीय प्रसक्ता नाम तेशाम तया अपहृत चेतसाम तया अपहृत चेतसाम अपहृत इज एक्चुअली यू नो दी इट इज हाईजैक द चेत चेतस मीन्स अंतकरण दिस इज अ बहुरी अपहृत चेत चेतो येशाम ते फॉर दोज हूज माइंड्स आर हाईजैक बाय बाय तया बाय बाय दैट बाय दैट कैंड ऑफ अ थिंकिंग भोगेश्वर्य प्रसक्ता नाम तया अपहृत चेतसाम व्हाट हैपेंस फॉर देम व्यवसायात्मिका बुद्धि व्यवसायात्मिका बुद्धि इज निश्चयात्मिका बुद्धि टू अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट इज द गोल व्हाट इज द पुरुषार्थ हाउ दैट पुरुषार्थ सिद्धि शुड रियली हैपन नॉट बाय स्वर्ग नॉट बाय कर्म हाउ शुड इट हैपन दैट कैंड ऑफ अंडरस्टैंड दिस बुद्धि हियर इज अंडरस्टैंडिंग एंड समाधि हियर इज इन द मीनिंग ऑफ बुद्धि इन द मीनिंग ऑफ This buddhi here is understanding. Samadhu is antakkarana here. Na vidiyate. Bhogaishwarya prasakta naam taya apahrata chetasam vyavasayatmika buddhi samadhu na vidiyate. They do not attain that kind of buddhi in their antakkarana. That kind of understanding does not take place. You see, in Bhashya, he says, Bhogaishwarya prasakta naam bhoga kartavya aishwaryancha. So, I should get bhoga, I should get aishwarya, that is their thinking. Therefore, they tadatma bhutanam. For them, 
the desire, the sabhava is being committed to bhoga and aishwarya and taya kriya vishesha bhulaya vacha. This vak is thrillinga. So with that kind of speech and that thinking which has led to that speech, that is the commitment. So due to that vak, apahruta chetasam, when somebody is talking rather, someone tells you that this is what you do and he is a karma kandhi. Then due to that speech, we may get influenced and when we get influ influenced, our mind is hijacked by that, that speech, that flowery speech, Pushpitam vacham pravadanti and taya vacha, taya pushpitaya vacha apahruta chetasam tesham. By, by that speech, if you get carried away, then what will happen, he says, Apahruta Chetasam Acharita Viveka Prajnana Your thinking is covered, is lost and then your mind is hijacked. Thereby what will happen? Vyavasayatmika. What is that Vyavasayatmika? Sankhya Yogeva. That buddhi Vyavasayatmika, Nishchayatmika buddhi can be towards Jnana or towards Karma Yoga. Samadhavuna Vidhyate. Samadhav means Samadhyate Asmin. Samadhav is the Saptam Yarthe derivation. It is Adhikarane Vitpatti and in that Samadhi, meaning in that Antakkarana, Asmin, Antakkarana, Buddhihi, Tasmin Samadhu, in that Antakkarana, Na Vidhiyate Na Bhavati Ityartha, that understanding is not there for them, it does not take place. So Na Vidhiyate means Na Bhavati, Bhogaishwarya, Varya Prasaktanam Taya in, into bracket what? Taya Vacha Apa Ruta Chetasam Vyava Sayatmika Puddhi Samadhu Antakkarane na vidhiyate does not take place. This understanding does not take place and they remain in samsara. That is the idea. Ye evam viveka buddhi rahitaha. Apahrata chetaha means what? Apahrata chetaha. The person who is apahrata cheta for him, uh, what is the other word? Viveka buddhi rahita. The person who is bereft of viveka buddhi, who cannot, who is bereft of the capacity to discriminate and see what is priya, what is shreya. So shreya and priya, priya you should be able to distinguish. When that does not happen because this flowery speech uh, carries one away from the goal and one remains engaged in uh, meeting of the desire to get bhoga and aishwarya. Ye evam viveka buddhi rahita, rahita bhavanti tesham kamatmanam for this kamatmana yat phalam tadah kamatmanam yat phalam tadah What is the phala that will accrue to these people? Traigunya vishaya veda this traigunyo bhavarjuna nirdvandu nitya sattvasto niriyo vakshema atvavan What is the phala which will come tesham kamatmanam yat phalam tadah here he explains that phala, but Nistraigunya is the Vishaya. Nistraigunya Vishaya is the phala. Veda is Traigunya Vishaya, therefore Traigunya Triguna Samsara is the phala. So that phala is not directly said here that this is the phala. Bhashyakara says that Vedas are Traigunya Vishaya. Traigunya Vishaya ha Veda ha Vedas are what are Vedas? They are, their Vishaya is what? Triguna is the Vishaya. The Traigunya, Traigunya is Samsara, that which has three Gunas. What is made up of three Gunas? Samsara is made up of three Gunas, Sattva, Rajas and Tamas. So, Sattva, Rajas and Tamas, Rupa, Samsara is Traigunyam. Traigunyam, Samsara, Vishaya, Vishaya, Yasya, or sorry, Yesham, Yesham, Vedanam, Te Vedaha, those Vedas are what? Traigunya Vishayaha, Bahurihi. 
Vedas and therefore there what will Vedas give, will give you? They will give you anything that is there in the three gunas or basically combination of three gunas. So result is only phalam. Yat phalam is samsara. Samsara eva phalam. Samsara rupa phalam it can give you. It can give you swarga which is also part of samsara. It can give you brahmaloka part of samsara. It can give you Vaikuntha part of samsara, Kailasa part of samsara, all these are nothing but samsara. It can give you Adhugati part of samsara or it can give you better gati. Both are part of samsara because they are all Traigunya and Traigunya is the Vishaya for which Veda, that Veda is Traigunya Vishaya. Vedas and Vedas here, although Vedanta is included in Vedas, but still when Vedas are separately talked about, then uh, against in contrast to Vedanta, then here it means only uh, karma kanda, upasana and karma. They are traigunya vishya, so nistraigunya bhava arjuna. You, however, therefore, rather therefore, he arjuna, you be nistraigunya, you be uh, nirgataha nistraigunya. Here it is nistraigunya, he arjuna, you tom. Bhava, you become, what should you become? Nistraigunya in Pullinga. So, uh, Traigunyam, uh, Nirgatam Traigunyam Yasmat. So, this is uh, Nirgatam. Nirgatam means gone away. What is gone away? Traigunyam means samsara. Samsara is gone away, means commitment to samsara, being stuck here, that is gone away. Nistrai, nirigatam traigunyam yasmat, that is gone away from whom? That kind of person you should be. Saha nistraigunyaha, and you become that. He Arjuna, he Arjuna, tom nistraigunyo traigunyaha bhava, that is the idea here. Because this can give you only samsara, and what is that? Vedaha Traigunya Vishayaha Bhavanti. So you go beyond this karma kanda, that is the idea here for moksha, for moksha, Arjuna. And what is that? Nirdvandvaha. Dvandva is gone away. What is the dvandva? Shoka moha. Earlier, what the pair, dvandva is oppo, pair, but a pair of opposites here. You be free from nirgataha, uh, nirgata dvandva yasmat, from whom dvandva has also gone away. Uh, thinking that shi toshna, sukha dukha, all these ideas you should drop off. So therefore you become nirdvandva. Uh, so tvam nistraigunyaha nirdvandva bhava. And what else should you be? Nitya sattvastha. So nitya sattvastha meaning nityam. Sattva guna should be nitya, not uh, tamaha or not rajoguna. Don't be uh, influenced by rajoguna and tamoguna. Remain in sattva which is nitya. So nityam sattvam. Sattvam is sattva guna. Sattvam. Nityam sattvam, nitya sattvam. And nitya sattvam. Satabhava sattvam. Sattvam and then Tasmin Tishthati Tasmin Tishthati iti Nitya Sattvastaha So be one who remains in free from three gunas but don't give up Sattva because that Sattva will take you finally to Moksha becoming Nirdvandvaha Nitya Sattvaha Nitya Sattvastaha Upapada Tatpurusha Nitya Sattve Tishtati Iti Nitya Sattvaha And again Niri Yoga Kshema Yoga is what? Apraptasya Praptihi Yoga And Praptasya Rakshanami Kshema What you don't have Struggling to get that is Yoga Because it will This effort will join you to that result And then that is Yoga What you already have Rakshanam, protecting that is Kshema. So, Yoga and Kshema. The entire life is Yoga and Kshema. What you already have, you don't want to give up. All the good, you want only good. Good as in, actually you want only that which you like. 
so wherever there is raga you want to accumulate more and more so there is yoga uh, trying to accumulate and then the shema whatever we have we want to protect therefore that will keep one in samsara being driven by raga dvesha niryoga kshema be niryoga kshema become one who is who has given up this yoga and kshema association niryoga kshema आत्मवान वॉट इज दट आत्मवान भव आत्मवान मीन्स आत्मा अस्ति 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 आत्मवान एवरी वन हैज आत्मा एक्चुअली राहु शिरो वी यू आर आत्मा देर इज नो आत्मा बट आत्मा देर इज अंतकरण इफ आत्मा इज अंतकरण देन वन हू हैज अंतकरण एवरी वन हैज अंतकरण हो एवरी वन डज हैव अंतकरण बट अंतकरण इज नॉट यूज एज बुद्धि इट इज नॉट यूज एज विवेक विवेक बुद्धि रहिता इफ पीपल हू आर विवेक बुद्धि रहिता they have antakarana but that antakarana behaves like manaha and that mana hijacks them and antakarana is stuck only being sankalpa vikalpatmakam it cannot be anything more but you should have viveka buddhi so that you can have vyavasayatmika buddhi nischayatmika buddhi you can conclude your journey which has been beginningless into this purushartha siddhi which is moksha therefore karma yoga or jnana yoga you should pick up based on your readiness if your chitta shuddhi is there then you give up all karma and take sanyasa he is telling arjuna if you do not have chitta shuddhi then please fight the battle which is your own dharma and with that swalpam api asya dharmasya trayato trayate mahato bhayat you will be protected it protects you and then pratyavayana vidyate you cannot go wrong therefore you continue that for chitta shuddhi so take to one of these but with conviction and thereby atmavan bhav use your viveka buddhi therefore atmavan antakaranavan buddhiman ityartha bhav so that's the idea here uh, in this verse so we'll stop here i'll just uh, make the uh, mark the cases here निस्त्रैगुण्य विषया वेदा निस्त्रैगुण्य भव भव इज मध्यम पुरुष एक वचन लोटलकार भूदा तो अर्जुन निर्द्वंद निस्त ऑल दिस इज फर्स्ट केस सिंग्युलर यू बी दिस कैंड ऑफ अ पर्सन आत्मवान भव आत्मवान एक्चुअली आत्मा देर आत्मा कैन हैव परमात्मा मीनिंग ऑल्सो परमात्मवान मीन्स बीइंग कमिटेड टू परमात्मा there is another meaning that uh, is taken by uh, i think uh, in some tika i saw that uh, yeah so i think madhusudana saraswati says in uh, gudartha deepika i just uh, happened to look up i wanted to see what atmavan is seen as atma parmatma dhyayatvena yoga kshemaadi nirvahakatvena cha vartate yasya sa atmavan so parmatma dhyayatvena vartate yasya one for whom Uh, atma is there atma means parmatma is there that is the matu partha there but as as what dhyatvena one who is continuously thinking of parmatma that kind of a person you be so atma one can have that meaning also so i'll say antakarana one antak atma atma antakaranam विवेक बुद्धि मीनिंग विवेक बुद्धि अस्य अस्ति इति दैट्स वन मीनिंग और व्हाट आत्मा परमात्मा ध्येयत्वेन अस्यास्ति इति दैट इज द अदर मीनिंग व्हिच मधुसूदन सरस्वती गिव्स so that's the anvya vedaha traigunya vishaya bhavanti he arjuna tvam tu on contrast what should you do nistraigunya bhav means nissamsara bhav go beyond samsara nirdvandva nitya sattvastah niryoga kshema atmavan bhav this is the anvya here om shanti 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 any questions no questions
ओके भवी आई सो यू क्लिक ऑन क्वेश्चन बट आई कुडेंट हियर यू कैन क्लिक अगेन मे बी Yes, Bhavya. Yeah. So you use some technical term for avipashti ta ha? I did not understand that. Uh, drop that. Look up the dictionary because it's uh, uh, there is prushodara divat sadhu. If the derivation is not mm -hmm. clear, then uh, prushodara. There is a word prushodara. So prushodara divat sadhu. See prushodara. If you see pr uh, prushan udara. So one who has spotted uh, belly. So udara. Udara is belly and it is spotted. So uh, so prushodara. what sadhu means how that form has come about to be there is a sutra there prushodara uh, so what should be the form if you say prushodara uh, prushad udaram okay so prushad udaram if you say then if you make a samasa bahuri prushad udaram yasya what should be the form of this uh, samasa word prushat udaram yasya what is prushat that? udaram prushat udaram ha prushat udaram so prushat udaram you don't get you get prushodara what happened to that uh, takara or dakara of prushat mm -hmm. so we don't know how it came about to be so there is a, a sutra look up uh, 63109 there prushodara dini yathopadishtam there is a sutra there so there mm -hmm. talopa is according to that sutra where you say that mm -hmm. prushodara divat sadhu so you see such forms then the commentator say prushodara divat sadhu where the regular uh, derivation cannot give you that form so something mm -hmm. happened and because it is used uh, by sadhu people it is like prushodara talopa happened due to that sutra so there are lot of uh, words which are included under that sutra mm -hmm. if it is seen as prushodara divat sadhu mm -hmm. so what will happen is that if you try to derive vipashchit vipashchit mm -hmm. uh, what is the dhatu how will you derive it v you can separate out vipashchit mm -hmm. so v uh, paschit paschit is what pashya dhatu can be there chit dha can be there so chit dhatu is there then uh, chetati mm -hmm. will come if uh, pash dhatu is there uh, drish drish dhatu and that form has become pashya then pashyati can be there the, can be the form so you don't know which is the derivation there therefore mm -hmm. prushadar adivat sadhu that word has come about to be in some way we are not able to derive it by just using some samasa rules therefore mm -hmm. prushodara divat sadhu mm -hmm. so uh, visheshana pashyati or uh, visheshana chetati pashyati chetati both can be there now you cannot have two dhatus but such mm -hmm. meaning is there to that uh, it's a meaningful word and you have that meaning but how that form comes about to be you can't give sutras for that only one sutra can be there which is prushodara dini yathos yathopadishtam so that sutra will give you that uh, uh, prushodara divat sadhu wherever you see prushodara divat then it is meaning prushodara divat sadhu from that sutra mm. is that clear thank you just look up the dictionary if you need more uh, this is what i i can make out of this okay okay mm. namaste mm. uh we are going at the pace of uh, around uh, say 5 or 5 to 6 to uh, shlokas per class uh, mm. i hope to pick up uh, pace once you are more comfortable with sanskrit and then i don't have to do each of this because if it is just an audio class we can go faster if it is uh, mm. uh, if it i have to do all these typing takes time and then if i have to explain uh, more sanskrit then it it's going to be lesser number of shlokas Mm. we'll see how we proceed uh, we'll try to pick up pace as we go okay let's see let's see